I'm uh, right now joined by head of the Iran's Atomic Energy Organization, Dr. Salehi. Thank you very much indeed for uh, your time, sir. Could you please tell us about the loading of uh, the core of uh, Bushehr nuclear power plant reactor? Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. You see, the startup of a reactor normally has different stages. The first stage uh, was uh, started on the 21st of August where we uh, transferred the fuel from outside the main building into the main building. And we put the, about 60 fuel assemblies into the storage house where the fresh fuel is stored. And then it took about two months from then until now to do different, to do different tests. In other words, uh, uh, washing the, the, uh, the pressure vessel and the, uh, and the storage uh, of the fuel uh, with the water and with acids. We have achieved this within two months, and now we are at the second stage, which is the most important stage, and probably it's the final stage, I would say, which is the transfer of the fresh fuel into the heart of the reactor, into the pressure vessel, into the core. So the fuel has been transferred into the core. We have started out this. We have to transfer about 163 fuel assemblies into the core, uh, we have been able since uh, early morning today to be able to transfer about three fuel assemblies. This will continue. It will take about two months to transfer all the fuel into the core. Well, this does not only mean that we are only doing the transfer, but we will be doing other testings while we are transferring the fuel. We will have to do so many tests uh, to make sure that everything is functioning properly. Hopefully, if everything goes well, Within two months, uh, the, uh, the reactor will be closed down. Uh, will be closed. I mean, the top of the reactor will be closed, and the reactor will start to be critical, and it start to produce power. But the power will be very low, and it takes about uh, probably one and a half month before the power reaches about 50 percent of the nominal power. Then it will be connected to the national grid and will start producing electricity about 500 megawatts. And then three months later, uh, we'll be able to produce the nominal power, which is about 1,000 megawatts. Well, do you have any plans to build more reactors in the future? Well, our priority now is to finish with the Boucher power plant. We have plans, but we have not yet touched that plan because we believe first we have to do all our uh, job with the nuclear power plant to finish our job with the new, I mean, with the first power plant of Boucher and to make sure that everything is properly uh, managed and uh, properly uh, done. And then this, in later stages, we will be looking into this uh, option. How about the nuclear uh, fuel swap deal? Uh, did you receive any um, uh, response, official response uh, for continuation of the talks? Well, uh, I think the delay is from the other side. We have always uh, stated that we are ready for this fuel swap deal uh, meeting. So we stated our readiness based on Tehran declaration. We have seen in the news uh, and, and, and the media that the other side is ready also, but we have not yet received official uh, confirmation of this readiness. Uh, but uh, we have been informed that the Director General of the IAEA is uh, pursuing this issue uh, very uh, earnestly, and uh, we hope that he will succeed in uh, finalizing the meeting between the, the, uh, the Vienna group meeting. Well, at the end of this interview, if you, there is any, uh, any point left, please go ahead. Well, I wish you success, and I would like to thank you for uh, joining us in this beautiful and memorable day. Thank you very much, thank Dr. You. Sali, for thank talking you. to us. Thank you very much.